stash the cottage fruit stash We've got some mangoes tomatoes barley dates avocados coconuts tomatoes more dates more avocados bananas plantains melons oranges looking awesome and then of course got the fridge looking pretty awesome as well what do we got we got more bananas that are too ripe, so they need to stay in there, not to ripen further. We got spinach, cilantro, cucumbers, dill, garlic chives. We got uh, lots of um, carrots, I'm gonna make some carrot juice. Lots of um, zucchini, more coconuts, kale. Um, Celery, nice grape stash here, perfect breakfast, sweet corn, more avocados, peppers, I mean, looking pretty epic, cottage fruit stash. our cabin this is where we go when we want to really just unwind relax tune out of the modern world and tune into nature and just get balanced you know so beautiful so fresh air natural surrounding quiet you can hear the wind and sheep ah, it's really beautiful it's just next to the seaside it's basically the Oslo fjord but it's way further south from Oslo, so it's, it's a, big, a pretty big fjord, you know. And during the summer you got boats, you know, all over this place taking their camping holiday on, s on the ocean. And uh, we have our boat, well it's not our boat, but we can use that boat sometimes. And that's very nice, we love riding our boat in the summer. Yeah. <laughs> 
brush taking a walk. <sighs> Breathing some dank oxygen, like Dan the man would say. Enjoying Norwegian nature at its best. Bah. Take a tour of our cabin. Here's our uh, messy uh, hallway. Lots of clothes for the cold climate. Here's our kitchen where we have uh, everything we need to have a good time. Here's our little compost bin that we're emptying uh, at least once a day, that bucket there. Um, Fridge. There's our fruit stash diminishing. And our mom eating some melon. And uh, here's our living room. Very cozy and very nice. We got our banana stash ripening there next to the um, oven or stove or I don't know. Um, very nice. There's the view from the Door. The weather is a little bit grey today and uh, not so good but that's how Norway is, very unpredictable and after September you can't really expect any comfortable weather until May or June next year. Let's take a walk up upstairs. Well actually before we go upstairs, check it out. Here's the toilet. This is a compost toilet. So really cool. Here, check it out. Looks like a normal toilet, but lo and behold, there is poo at the end of the tunnel. So that's great stuff so because this way, all our poo and uh, goes in there with the uh, bark that we put on top each time instead of flushing. And then, um, and then after a while we turn the chamber so we get a new fresh chamber and that other chamber just stays there and starts composting and over time you get great soil that you can use to grow food or whatever but I think most of the time we just end up throwing it away right <laughs> wasting the resource I think anyway really nice view here when you're taking a taking a shit and sit and look out in the woods very nice energy here, very like calm and relaxed energy in this cabin. Here's the bathroom, just like a sink and a mirror, whatever. Brush our teeth in the evening. And then upstairs, come on. Dark and scary. We have three rooms. Um, very simple. set up just no big deal straight up messy 
That's how it is. So, that's how it is. That's our cabin. Um, this is where we go when we want to really relax, take it easy, just tune in to nature and breathe fresh air and just de-stress. It's nice, it's right by the seaside so we can look out on the ocean and we can swim in the summer even though it's pretty cold. Ride our boat, it's pretty awesome. Thanks for watching.